Hi there! In this video I'm going to show you how to make this bead bracelet. The stringing is simple enough that you could do it with kids. So to make this bracelet you will need first of all about a yard, 36 inches of bead stringing wire. You'll also need some beads. For a bracelet that fits about a seven and a quarter inch wrist you'll need 19 eight millimeter beads and 36 six millimeter beads. I have here these eight millimeter faceted glass beads from House of Gems and then I have these six millimeter beads made of olive jade. To finish your bracelet you'll need two crimps, two crimp covers, and a toggle clasp. So the first step is to slide one piece of your toggle clasp onto your bead stringing wire. Then bring the two ends together and slide on a crimp bead over both wires. Slide it all the way down to your toggle and then crimp. Test to make sure that's strong. Then pick up a crimp cover and gently squeeze it over that flattened crimp. Next, take one of your 8mm beads, slide one end of your wire through the bead hole. Then slide the other end of the wire through the bead hole in the opposite direction. And pull the bead up all the way down to your toggle clasp and you want, this is probably the trickiest part of the whole bracelet, you want to get it so that there's the same amount of wire on each side. So you might have to fiddle with it a little to get it centered. Just like that. Next you're going to slide one of your olive jade beads onto each of the strands of wire. Slide them all the way down to the first bead and now it's just a matter of repeating those last two steps. Pick up an 8 millimeter bead slide one wire in from one side and slide the other in from the other side and then pull them up. You don't have to pull them really tight, just pull them snug and I would recommend that you use a wire that is a color that goes with your beads because some of it will be visible. And then we'll just repeat, add two more of your smaller beads and then both wires through your larger bead. And continue until you have your bracelet length that you want. You should probably try it on your wrist. It should just about meet the clasp. You should have a little bit of room for your additional clasp to go on. So you're going to end with one of your larger beads and then we'll finish much as we started by putting both wires through a crimp and then put them through the other piece of your clasp and back through the crimp. Now if you find that they won't both fit through the crimp that's okay we can trim off one of them outside of the crimp. So we're just going to pull this all up snug again have that centered over that eight millimeter bead and then crimp that bead trim off both of those wires and cover with the crimp cover as before. And here's our bracelet all done. This is a fun project to do with kids. If they need a little help finishing the ends with the crimps you can do that for them but the stringing is something that they can do and of course it's a lot of fun to choose your favorite colors and combinations that you love. So happy creating!